If there's one thing that I cannot live without. And comb the hair. Rainy, rainy day. So, can't ride my car because I lost my keys and the spare one doesn't work. So in the meantime, this is gonna be my ride. I know I made a video a couple months ago on how I quit work and decided to go on this venture, but uh, looks like I'm back to work, but not at the same thing I was doing, but uh, yeah. It has rhinestones, it has, it has rhinestones, rhinestones. Uh, I don't know, it doesn't seem cool though, seeing a guy drive around with a car and rhinestones license plate. Just finished listening on my way to work, commuting again. Well, it's actually the first time in a while that I commute to work, but it's not bad. But uh, anyways, I just finished listening to uh, the MF CEO project by my man, Andy Priscilla. Just got me jacked up. You know, it's one of those podcasts that just like punches you in the face, slaps you, kicks you in the ass. And it's just get to it, you know. It's not for everybody though. I do recommend it, but it's not for the faint of heart. Um, I mean, he just gives it to you straight how it is. I resonate a lot with it because that's how my dad was with me a lot growing up. It's just just give it to you blunt, no filters, just you know, big old slap in the face right now. But you know, uh, just kind of on my way to work, I like to listen to stuff. Um, to kind of keep me in track as far as podcasts, uh, reading audiobooks, um, or sometimes music, just find little little tricks to stay in track. But uh, kind of going back to um, what uh, the podcast today was about was about the uh, whole New Year's resolutions. Um, you know, it's we're five days in, it's January fifth, and there's already people giving up and quitting and going back to the old habits and saying that they're gonna achieve these goals, but they're already slipping away. And and I unfortunately I know some of these people, um, but it is it is what it is, you know. I myself set some I don't want to say New Year's resolutions or goals, but there's certain things that I'm working on. And it's the fifth day, and I'm still you know it's it's a it's a continuous effort. It's not like it just you wake up and magically it happens but you know uh, what Andy was talking about is how people you know they like the idea of success they like uh, uh, they like the feeling of, of wanting to achieve a certain status whether it be financial or physical or it doesn't matter what what it is that people aim to do but you know when it comes down to it and you don't see any progress you don't see any anything moving you just feel like nothing's going on and or it's hard it, it is hard and people just tend to fall out or take the easy route or you know it's easier to just watch tv it's easier to just you know uh, go hang out with a friend get some beers or something but it sucks to see that you know people even people that come ask me like yo how do you do this how can i do that and i tell them it's like okay follow this and i mean from from what i learned and from what i've experienced and yet they stop doing it for whatever reason or honestly I tell people you if you really want it you'll stick to it and you'll find a way long enough for it to work and you know um, I don't know today's podcast just really jacked me up on my way to work and it and it made me think about the progress and the adventure that I'm taking on right now with this whole building my my uh, my business my brand um, the decisions I've taken um, the just gunning it uh, quitting work Going back to work was not because I quit on what I'm doing or because uh, I gave up or because it's hard. That it's hard, yeah, it's it's really hard and there's days where I'm just like, like today I'm like, why am I doing this? Like, why can't I be normal? Why can't I just stick to the nine to five? Why can't I just, you know, but I'm just, I'm just not wired like that for some reason. Um, for some time I did did consider that was you know success that was like the thing to do is to just go to work nine to five and come home and 
watch TV or, or hang out with friends, grab some beers, and that's it. But something inside me was just eating me alive after I finished school. There's more to life. Uh, even nowadays, it's like it's it's gonna it's continuing to be a monotonous thing. Even with even including work that I have to do for uh, and I don't like to call it work for my business. It's, it's stuff that I need to get done on a daily basis. Um, even that's getting to a monotonous thing where I have to break the the uh, uh, the daily routine. Sometimes, like even randomly throw random trips or or go somewhere just to kind of keep myself in check. The reason why. I went back to work is because, well, um, I need a capital to reinvest and back to what I'm doing. And also because when you're starting in a, in a business, um, and this is from experience, is you have a lot of free time. And a lot of the free time, you either spent it kind of uh, chasing your own tail and if money's not coming in, well, I have a kid and bills to pay. So even though with the business I had was covering at least the monthly expenses, but I need a capital to reinvest back into my, my business. So that's why I went back to, to work. So it's not like I gave up or I quit. But um, it's been an interesting, interesting uh, ride. All, all I'm going to say is, uh, I mean, I'm not, I'm not no one to say anything, but just keep at it. Keep going and, you know, be relentless. day at work heading home to go do more work that's pretty much uh, how my life is now so so that's a wrap for the day so just kind of wanted to let you guys know what uh, I've been up to because uh, I've been asked like oh, so what's been going on and stuff like that so um, hope you guys like the video uh, I gotta get back to work um, well Technically not work, but um, I do some stuff on the Mac. And uh, so hope you guys enjoy the video. Um, please like and share, and um, check out the page. Uh, this is kind of a prototype that we're working on. Working on some other stuff, so that's kind of what my time's being consumed. That mostly is figuring out how we're gonna get the stuff out for you guys. And uh, so check us out. I'll put the uh, links below, and uh, we'll catch you guys next time. All right. Peace.